sounds like an extraordinary amount of sirens. What a beautiful looking day it is. A little chilly, but not so bad. Going to Joanne Fabrics. Discovered something new last night while eating dinner. If I start chewing with the retainer thing in, it has the tendency to pop out. And in doing so, it popped out and then hit the area that it's supposed to be protecting where the tooth is missing. So I started, I, tr I tried just taking it out and just chewing carefully, not near that area. And it worked a thousand times better than chewing with the thing in. So it's, it's now coming out when I eat, is what I've decided. And he mentioned that that might be the case, the dentist did, but I was like, well, why would I do that? Then it's wide open to have stuff stab into it. But I know this is riveting. What's going on up there? It looks like they're trying to fit something through that window. Drywall. I just want to ask them. To leave? What is it about? What are you protesting exactly? Oh, nothing? Just they're, they're walking away with it now. They're done protesting it. They have solved the issue. So is there a way to figure out um, if needles are right? Mm -hmm. We go and carry singers, and I don't think Vikings are universal. Oh. Okay. Um, Bob, and maybe when she gets back, she might, since she has a machine, she might be able to tell you by the number. Okay. You know how when you go to check out at a place and they ask you if you found everything okay? Have you ever said no and seen how they don't give a shit and don't help you find the thing that you're saying no you couldn't find? It's just words. Stop just saying words and listen when you ask somebody a question. Cheese. Well, I don't even... It's kind of cool. I found this in a front aisle that doesn't really go to anywhere, but instead is just so you can have pictures seen from the outside. Hmm. For those watching this who don't know, these two green buildings on the right were both at one point RDS, uh, and then we moved to where we're at now. But looking across the street, this used to be just fields of stuff, and we were coming past here earlier and noticed that there were a bunch of, you know, what do you call it, streets put into the road. And this is going to be a cemetery, it looks like. There's already some a few graves, but I've never really seen the beginning of a cemetery before. I just thought that was noteworthy. I'm not sure if I reached the right department. I need to discuss with somebody an incident with my daughter yesterday. Okay. Um, if it's disciplinary, it would be the assistant principal. Well, it's if not. It's, it's related to grades or something along those lines. I can have you speak with her counselor. I mean, I could tell you what it is, and you could direct me in the right way, if that helps. I could try. I sure can. Okay. Um, she apparently was wearing a shirt that did not meet the dress code, so the resulting solution was to have her remove the shirt. And she came home in a bra and a, a, a little zip-up jacket. So I'm, mm. I'm very confused about what happened, why she wouldn't just be told to put the jacket on rather than give me your shirt. It seems right. ridiculous. I, that would be um, Tracy Seibert, who's our assistant principal. Okay. I'm going to transfer you down that way. Thank you if much. If she does not pick up, that means she's supervising lunches and she'll call you back as soon as she gets into her office, okay? Okay. okay. Hi, you have reached the voice mailbox of Tracy Seibert, assistant principal at Taft Middle School. I am away from my desk. Please leave me a detailed message and I will get back to you as soon as possible. Thank you. You may start your message now. Hi, my name is Joel Henderson. My daughter is Angelina Henderson. <clears throat> I was just looking for a little clarity on an incident that occurred yesterday. Um, I guess she was wearing a shirt that was deemed inappropriate for the dress code, and I fully support that. But she came home without the shirt, 
and she was just wearing a bra and like a zip up jacket. So I, I just needed some clarification on how it went from that shirt's inappropriate to give me that shirt, let's take it off and then go home with a bra on. Uh, I'm just, like I said, I'm just a little lost on how we, how that escalated so quickly and that was the reasonable reaction rather than just put the jacket on or call the parents and say, come pick her up. She's not dressed appropriately. If you could give me a call, like I said, I'm just, I'm not looking for any big thing. I just want to know why it was take the shirt off rather than just go home or whatever. So just give me a call. Thanks. I didn't mention this yesterday, but there was an incident at Lena's school where her shirt apparently didn't meet the dress code. And, uh, she was telling me this morning that in first hour somebody said something so she put a jacket on and then she left the jacket over it and then or they said he had to pull the shirt up or down I can't remember which way it was it doesn't matter the point is it ended up being a thing where they said you can't wear that shirt so the logical solution was for them to call me and me to come pick Lena up or bring her a change of clothes but that's not what happened what happened is they they told her to remove the shirt so she came home in a bra with a zip, up, like a hoodie thing zipped up over it. It's like, how is that the reasonable solution rather than telling her to put her jacket over what she was wearing? Nothing about that makes any sense. So I'm hoping that they have better answers for me than nothing. Just checking this out and on, sil on mute so I can see Alan's hands. Let's see how much he moves his hands. What could he be saying? What could he be demonstrating? What is he measuring right there? Yeah, it is big. I know, it's large. Oh, stretch it, Stre knead the dough. Is he playing an accordion? Is it invisible? Oh, no, what's he doing now? I'm not sure. Oh, expanding, expanding. Oops, two thumbs up. This is my favorite game ever. Trying to figure out what Alan's saying based on his hands. Oh, they're down. He's not saying anything? No. Still. Okay, guys, come back to my office. Come on. Do they can stay up here if they want. They're fine, but they're gonna sit at the table. Okay. So this one just popped her shoulder back into socket. Oh, oh, god! It's only been out all day. <laughs> flashy, 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 flashy. What is that? Flashy, flashy, flashy. That's her song. Oh. Flashy, flashy, flashy. Do you like The Simpsons? Yeah. And Who's your favorite character? My favorite characters are so mysterious and in, in fight against each other. Who? It's a mouse and a cat. Okay. The mouse is blue and the cat is black. Okay, and what's their names? It's not black. Uh, the cat is starts with S. Why are you being cryptic? Just tell me their names. Itchy and Scratchy. Of course those are your favorites. You'd be lucky if I don't. Wait till you get to the episode with the Itchy and Scratchy movie. That's gonna teach you all you need to know about Five Nights at Freddy's, the band. Does Bart ever get to see it? No. Does all you, the people in wine wait and get to see it. But he, we, the what why leads all the way to the Simpsons house. Yeah, and what did you learn from that? For the band of Friday to Freddy's. What about it? It's it's too fun. It's not that violent. It's just a little violent, and it's scary. What's up, guys? Hey. How's life? Hey. Is it a a s f? I have what? rainbow hair. You do have rainbow hair. It's beautiful. Okay, go play in the room. Hey. Kids stopped by and totally didn't make a oh, huge mess. What? It's just like. <laughs> it wasn't working. Oh, it's magic. It's magic. Turned about this weekend, then she got, and then I was like, hey, it was weird. She goes, oh shit. Like, it's just like, what? Oh, I can't believe it. Oh, I can't believe it. That was pretty hilarious. I don't know amazing. what the story was, but it was really good. It was one of my favorite stories Stop. of all the you times. So this is the mom sitting in the studio. And I'm Kenzie. 
Oh, I can't wait to post that. And I'm Kenzie. And I'm Kenzie. I watched your more than a woman video. It was pretty funny. Like, the beginning of it. I think it was the one that you sent me. Oh, yeah, just that little clip. Oh, yeah. my God. Dude, I was laughing so hard. I think I still have it on my phone, actually. Yeah. Yeah, it's ridiculous. I love the part where Ivy's just pooping in the art and you're like, and he's like, Joe. Yeah, I said something. Yeah, I'm like, yeah what? It, said, it says Joe. And then you look, and then you you, you go, and start singing again. It's going to take me a little bit to warm up, so don't mind me singing while we're doing this. Yeah, it doesn't matter. La, 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 la. Yes, you're welcome to suck at singing. Stop. She doesn't. She never did or, or choir, so she doesn't know the like. Oh, like the. Doe a deer, a female deer, ray a drop of golden sun. See, it, he just put some light, light up so I couldn't see you anymore. I call myself far, a long, long way to run. So a needle pulling thread. Yeah, I don't remember either. La, a no to follow so. Tea, a drink with a drink with jam and bread. bread. That will bring us back to go, do, 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 a deer, a bee. Okay, I'm out. <laughs> no smoke, no smoke. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Get high, get high. Get high. Oh, 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 oh. That nigga my homie. Come on the fuck hoes. Man, so you get money. We love, we joke. Cause I love you. Is that the set? Are you like actually playing? No smoke, no smoke, no smoke. It is a super long song. <laughs> wow. Your mom is beautiful. I was going to say weird. Come to Recording with Sam. Make your friends jealous and make them stand outside. <laughs> and, have oh my God. and then have a seizure. <laughs> no, hey. Make Wait, don't do that last thing. No, make your music. Be a boss. Drink water. Be sassy. Yeah, I was reading love. That. I was reading that. <laughs> she literally did that. And I was like, she did all of you that. just messed it up. You are me. Just like me. Hey, pretend you like your uncle for a minute. <laughs> You're welcome for making such a fabulous <laughs> song. <laughs> Just filmed a little thing with Kenzie and Sammy and Jenna and Lena, and now I'm going to do some light painting. Later, guys. Merry Christmas, Tom! I imagine she'd call you Tom. Right. That must be Iris, right? I don't know, what does it say? Sorry I'm late. I didn't want to come. <laughs> that almost could be you. <laughs> Let me get some Christmas music going. What is this? 
<laughs> what? Jesus fucking Christ. What does that say on it? Lost the time. <laughs> yeah. That's what I'm talking about. All kinds of delicious beverages on my waist. She said that was ridiculously hard to make. I imagine. <laughs> but I mean, come on. Outstanding gift. Well done. That's great. It's there. And I don't like- stop it. I'm, stop. I might just start getting these, like, off- I, It would be worth it to lose a pinky. Go ahead. Dude, it would be, you would lose your hand, bro. <laughs> That's a fucking 45. Ooh, it works. So where are we going? Union Station. Union Station, yeah? Mm. Cheers. Nighttime adventure. Got some Coke? Me too. I have some. Oh. It's a different world out here at night, says Big Town. Oh, that well, was something. You have random people just squatting everywhere, and you can't see them because they're squatting and they're low and it's dark, and then you trip over them, and then you start a fight, and then you drink vodka, and then just the, the fucking escalates. There was, there was no vodka prior to fight? Oh, well, no. It just it magically appears. Well, sir, what is going on is we are walking inside the Union Station. because there is a piano in there. Downtown in the Gary's. The scary Gary's. It's not scary at all. It's fucking, it's just another thing. If you're watching this and you're afraid to come to Gary, quit being a wussy. Here we are looking for piano. place is just I can't believe those stairs still work to go up there what's that oh I mean are you gonna be able to slob squat for Mission successful. If your peanut butter is smooth, next time get Diffy Smith. Peanut butter. It sticks to the roof of your mouth, so does Charlie. Yeah. Any guesses? Fred Power Ranger. Fine Methodist Church. Um, we're gonna go do some light painting in there as well. Definitely gonna run into somebody. Go, go, Power Rangers. Yeah, Charlie Badgers is here. <laughs> oh. Come on, flashlight. Lose it. Who cares? You have that. Yeah, I mean, this room with that. Watch the nails. I'm watching. I mean, I can't see because you're not lighting very well, but. Better than I used to be, but never understood a thing. Can't be who I am meant to be because I'm afraid of me. What am I supposed to do? Can I ask of you that to have faith in me? Not everything's a tragedy. Okay, he made it. That was a lot more solid than I thought. Yeah. Here we go. At least it looks not creepy at all in here. Jeez, look at all that shit falling from this thing right above us. that red light thing? It's a reflector. Hey, can you bring that over here? <laughs> <laughs> you just did it, see? I want to go. You can see the light through that thing. Watch. Boom! That was so cool. This is like there's lightning in here. Watch. Wait for it as soon as this thing turns around again. Watch. <laughs> That's... Oh, good. Watch the barbed wire. Yeah, this is a much better way, Charlie Badges. What in the shit? How am I going to get through here with all my fatness? So detached with my membrane still intact. Embrace 
what you cannot change. I'll find a remedy someday. Charlie Burgess. Good. Imagine us now he's got a sore thing. shin. The wet stage. Now he's got a sore shin. Oh, my shin is killing me. This one's out to the kids, surrendering to their wits. I wish to the stars that we stay who we are. It is close to 11 p.m. And I'm still not on the fucking wall. I'm still not on the goddamn wall. Explain Come that. Come out. Oh, bullshit. It better be before 10 a.m. Mm. Mm. How are you this ice cream? Yeah, how's the ice cream? Good. Hi, Riss. Hey. Uh, I didn't say hey, Riss. Hey, Riss. It doesn't work. Troll. Going home now. Are you pointing more guns at me? Mm. Of the finger variety? All these memories in my mind, my mind, my mind, my mind, my mind, my mind. I'm still a secret lemonade drinker, drinker. 